Hey, what it do, y'all? What it do? What it do? What it do? What it do? It's your boy G, and we back with another video. And yeah, we got another interesting one, y'all. Cause we keep it interesting over here on this channel. And yeah, if you haven't yet, most definitely smash that sub and hit that like for your boy. And yeah, y'all. Mm-hmm. We are on the brink of the Devin Haney versus Ryan Garcia fight. What y'all thinking? How y'all thinking? How y'all seeing it? Mmm. Now I must say, I was gonna put this video out beginning of this week. And I kinda sat on it. And I must say, I'm kinda glad I did. Because at first, I'm looking at this fight like, yeah. Oh yeah, straight head up. Good match off. The boy Ryan ready. The boy Devin ready. They gritty, they grimy, they coming for each other. Backstage, getting at each other, all that. The vibes is there. You see what I'm saying? Like this shit up right now, if you feel where I'm coming from. You see what I'm saying? Good fight, building it up, right? You know what I'm saying? Now, just lately, we got Ryan looking pretty nervous. I don't know. Maybe Ryan smoking the good Zaza and don't know how to just be chill at an interview but i must say the boy looking a little shook i don't know y'all tell me what y'all think i don't think ryan will, will meet me in the middle i don't think he's ready for that kind of fight i was just looking i was going ryan you were uh you seem skeptical yeah. to say the least that devin will will go to the middle of the ring and slug it out with you do you believe that's going to happen no he won't why don't you think that what do you think i'll do I just, I just don't think you're gonna go in the middle of the ring. I just, I mean, that that would be stupid. Why? All right, come, come to the center. Come to the center. I'll meet you in the center. <laughs> what the fuck? Come to the center. All right, we're going to the center of the ring. We'll see what you do, <laughs> bro. Nobody's worried about that. Go run. Go fucking go to the center. Do whatever the fuck you want. I'm gonna hunt you down. I'm just, I'm gonna fucking knock you out. Five hundred thousand dollars. Five hundred thousand. How much? But right, 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 right. Hey, so whoever come overweight, pay five hundred thousand. hundred percent. Okay, that's a bet. I'm not gonna yeah, come out no, of weight. Whoever come overweight, pay five hundred thousand. His dad said no. Oh, he just bet. He just bet. It's a 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 bet. No, five. No, no, five. No, for, it's a bet. No, five hundred. Five hundred. Five hundred. No, five hundred thousand per pound. Hey, hey, Ryan. Ryan. Ryan, hey, uh, hey, Ryan. Whatever you say, Dad. I hey, got you. Hey, Ryan, let's do five hundred thousand per pound. Okay. Let's do a shake on it. Yeah. Oh shit! Now that's, now that's professionalism. Hey, where's your mama at, baby? Where's Where's your mom? Oh, I'm gonna go flirt with your mama. Ooh. Ryan, a lot, a lot of people, Ryan, have, have followed your social media over the last couple of months and wondered, is he ready for this moment? What would you say to people that wonder if you're ready for this moment? Y'all see Saturday night. That's it. Simple. Devin, your prediction for the outcome of this fight? Something is wrong with this motherfucker. I'm going to tell you, no, nah, something wrong with him. Not normal. This it's not normal. That's what happens when you face the Devin the Dream, Haney. Yeah, you're gonna go one way or another. Yeah. Yeah, that's fast. Yeah. It's fast. That's, I am different. That's fast. It's, it's all clicking in. So when Mike talk, never mind. Fuck, man, fuck you guys. Ryan, we'll give you the last word. How do you think this fight ends? I'm gonna, I'm gonna break his neck. All right. We'll leave it at that. Eight o'clock Eastern time, live on DAZN Worldwide. Tickets available at Barclays Center, Oscar. Now, y'all see what I'm saying? Buddy looking a little nervous now, and that ain't never good for nothing. Now, it's true facts. Most performers, maybe all performers, usually get nervous before they hit the stage. It just come with prepping and getting ready before you do something. You see what I'm saying? But I must say, this type of nervousness in the realm of boxing is never good. You see what I'm saying? Now, Ryan, if you in here right now, let me tell you something, dog. It's all right to be a little nervous now. You see what I'm saying? But you got to fight it out, my dog. You see what I'm saying? This is the life that you train for. 
Now you want to talk like an animal leading all the way up to the fight. And as soon as the fight get here, you want to look like this? I don't know, Ryan. You might need to change your career or something. Because I'm telling you, dog, you get whooped. And this is how you was looking. It's like, damn, we knew Buddy was scared. I mean, but that's all right, though. Because there's a lot of people who have this certain effect to them where they're, you know what I'm saying, kind of like the Tank Davis effect. You back him down on the corner, he going to figure it out. He going to come out swinging. Almost like the Max Holloway, even though Max Holloway said, come here. He said, get over here type. But yeah, it's some certain vibes where you bag a beast down into a corner and they're going to unleash. And they're going to explode. And if they get off with some good shots when they explode, then you might just hit the flow. But Devin Haney looking like he ready. I must say, training looks like it went well. He looks prepared. He looks concentrated. He looks confident. Keeping it calm, shoulders high, you see what I'm saying? Playing the smooth, just as any boxer should. Straight poker face, you see what I'm saying? You don't know how I'm coming. But you know you about to see me in that ring. I don't know, y'all, what y'all thinking. I must say, before this interview, I was thinking this is like a fair 50-50 fight. I mean, Devin got some hands. Check his record. He got some hands. Garcia, he got some hands. Check his record. Now, yeah, he did take that phantom punch from Tank Davis. But like I said, when you lose to other greats, it is what it is. It wasn't like Davis was a bum. So you, so, so we got to give Ryan leeway. To do his thing in this fight. And I'm giving him leeway. All bets on the table. Who trying to bet it up? You see what I'm saying? Who trying to bet? You know, so this is going to be a good fight. Will it? This should be a good fight. That boy Ryan definitely looking a little shook. I must say. But he need to go ahead and let them two lions on his chest show themselves. Nigga got two lions tatted on his chest. What, you ain't like the first one or something? You can't have two lions in your chest, dog, and you out here getting pussy catted. You see what I'm saying? You can't have Scar and Mufasa on your shit and you out here getting Garfield. It don't work like that, Ryan. I'm just saying, my dog. And yeah, y'all, that's it for this one. What y'all think? Ryan or Haney? Should be a good fight. Ryan looking shook already. Uh, oh, you betting on Ryan. But yeah, y'all, that's it for this one. Make sure y'all smash that like, hit that sub, and stick around for more videos. Until next time, we out.